Hi, it's BBBBB, Barry B. Fit, and I'm back to get you on track. Welcome to our week five challenge Tuesday. And today's challenges, we had three of them, and um, they're not too hard. And I want you to get in and give it a go. And our first challenge today is going to be a step up. But before we start, make sure that you're doing your dynamic stretches and your static stretches. Uh, make sure your body's all loose and ready to go. Make sure you grab a drink before you start, during your activity, and also at the end of your activity. So what I want you to do is find a step. Now that could be, uh, it could be a step, some steps that you have at home. It could be a little plank at home. It could be just a little, um, um, something that you could step up onto. So I've got this little one here. Now I'm not very, um, not very young obviously. So I've got a, a little step up. So there's a couple ways that we can do it. I want you just to put one foot up and then the next foot up and then hop down. So we just go like that. Now there's other things you could do. We could do one just up like that, but I think I'd rather you do this one. One, two, down, one, two, down. And you're going to count. You're only going to have 30 seconds to get as many step ups as you possibly can. So here we go. Ready, set, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 60, 70, 80, 90, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. 35 seconds. See if you can beat Barry B. Fit. Good luck. Welcome back to our second of our challenges for week five of Challenge Tuesday. Now, this particular challenge is the squat challenge. Now, squats are quite hard to do, but I'll show you how to do it in a moment. Before we get started, you'll need a bucket from around the house and maybe a, a purse or I have a bean bag, but you can just have something that you can balance on the top of your head there. So I'm just going to use this bucket here and I'll quickly show you what a squat is. So a squat, it's basically when we can basically sit down as far as we can and hold that there and then come up. So we're looking at that right angle between our legs and our, our core there, our, our torso. So I'm going to stand just here, getting back onto the bean bag. We're just going to rest that there because we want that to balance and that'll help us to stay nice and straight. And we're going to do 30 seconds. Now the challenge for this week is to do as many squats as you can in 30 seconds. Now, I know I'm not going to do great at this one. I've just done the step up activity. So I'm already, my heart's pumping, but let's give it a go. So we'll count it in. So keep your arms up either high or at, lo at this position here, I don't mind. So ready, set, go. Twenty-five. Think you can beat Barry B? Go give it a go. Moving into our third and final challenge for week five, and this one is one that, whether you're little, whether you're big, doesn't matter how old you are, everyone can give this one a go. I'm sure we've all done a star jump before, or some people call them jumping jacks. Now, when you do a star jump, whenever your hands are up, touching each other, your feet need to be apart. Whenever your hands come down, you'll make one straight vertical line. So, 30 seconds, let's see how we go. Set, go. Thirty-nine. Thirty-nine. Better than one a second, not bad. Well done, Bavs. All right, go home, give it a go. See if you can beat Barry in the challenge. 